Good morning to all my YouTube fans out there. The picture that you are looking at is a picture of an old cunt by the name of Chrissy Gibson. She is the assistant city manager for the city of Boca Raton. And this old cunt thought that it would be a good idea to test the waters dealing with social media. She thought it would be a good idea to try her luck and talk tough on the phone. We warned her 84,000 views later, she's quiet as a church mouse right now. So this video this morning is titled Social Media Airstrikes Completion. The city of Boca Raton was warned via federal civil litigation notices to their city attorney in writing to his email address with confirmation that he received them. Basically, they were warned if they continued their racist behavior and injustice behavior that the videos would go on social media counted as discovery setting this all up for federal civil litigation in federal court now chrissy gibson had a phone conversation with me dealing with their city employees lying on black people claiming that black people sexually harassed them stalk them, so on and so forth. Chrissy Gibson's response was, well, you should have followed the rules. This is what she responded with, right? So I'm like, cunt, are you stupid? Are you really gonna sit up here on this phone and basically say that a person should have followed the rules and if a person does not follow the rules that we can do this, lie, defame your character, call the police. Chris, Chrissy Gibson is fully aware that all this stuff is going on with people of color in the community of Boca Raton. Christopher Fernandez patched me through to Chrissy Gibson. I told Chrissy Gibson, well, we're sitting on a lot of video footage dealing with the racism and Boca. Chrissy Gibson tried to talk tough on the phone, which then resulted in a massive social media airstrike, which then resulted in their chief of police getting exposed, the mayor getting exposed, the city manager getting exposed, it caused the domino effect. Now in reality, I told them, you can pay now or pay later. In result, you're still gonna pay regardless. The city of Boca and their racist rhetoric has been going on for decades. Social media is the problem solver. In the good words of Kevin Hart, they wasn't ready. And so they were not ready for the social media airstrike. And we will continue to bomb them. This is war. Now I'm going to address the fact that we're not responsible for any death threats that the city receives because of the videos. We're not responsible for that. They made their own bed, now they have to lie in it. We have no sympathy for the city of Boca at all. They didn't have sympathy for black people when they were kicking them out of public facilities, calling the police on them for non-crimes committed. They did a number on black people for decades. We have no sympathy for these people. But people like Chrissy Gibson, is the root of the problem. You cut the problem off at the head, period. The police chief is the root of the problem. 
they're still stuck in the 1940s, 50s, and 60s, where they think that racism is tolerated. Social media will continue to take care of them, though. This is a public service announcement. Also, the city of Boca is having a hard time hiring people. Why? Because they don't pay enough, you know? And all the white people are quitting because they're not paying enough. So in reality, you know, they're trying to get people hired by promising them all these benefits. Well, benefits don't pay the bills. Money pays the bills. So the only people that is willing to work for the city of Boca are black slaves. And just because the city hires black people, that doesn't mean that they're not racist. That doesn't mean that. That just means that, you know, they want to hire the dumbest of the dumb. This is what happens, you know? So we're going to continue releasing videos, even though the social media airstrike has now been completed. You know, they've been bombed several times. And uh, we're going to continue. This is what happens. You know, this is a war. You know, the channel's called Injustice Wars. They just wasn't aware that social media would do this to them this fast. Social media is taking care of them really quickly. 84,000 views on one video. Uh, 25,000 views on another video. 69,000 views on another video. Yeah, I would say social media is doing what it's supposed to be doing. Exposing all these racist old cunts like Chrissy Gibson, Mike Wika, you know. And uh, the hierarchy is white. The lower tier are black people. Phil, you're a loser, dude. You're a straight loser. So this completes this video. Thanks and have a great morning.